Chief Education Officer Dr. Fiona Philip Meyer has reported satisfaction with the opening of the third term of the academic year in the physical setting. Students returned to the classroom Monday, 19 April 2021 after adapting to virtual learning for the better part of the past year due to COVID-19. Indications of the transition back to the classroom setting has been generally smooth, with the Department of Education and the Ministry of Health working closely to ensure that protocols are adhered to. As a parent and long-serving educator, I'm well placed to appreciate the anxiety as well as relief associated with the reopening of school for many parents and staff. We are keenly aware of the efforts of many educators and applaud them for their preparations geared at welcoming our students back. We saw some creative and fun projects that reminded students of safety protocols while at the same time reaffirming their sense of belonging at the educational institutions island-wide. Well done everyone and thank you for your efforts. We thank you for this initial step at what we hope will be a sustained third term. Like other sectors of society, educational institutions will be managing COVID cases under the guidance of the Department of Health. We want to reassure parents that they will be contacted as per the need, and we hope there is no need to do so, but we want to reaffirm our commitment to always keeping them informed if their children are impacted in any way. We have staff, parents, and students who in some way or another may be impacted reference COVID-19. We wish therefore to remind all stakeholders of the specific responses to various scenarios that were developed prior to the reopening of school. We encourage everyone to practice and adhere to the protocols that are clearly established so as to reduce any possible spread. We must, especially as adults, be vigilant and responsible in our actions so as to reduce any risk to our younger ones. Our commitment is clear. Health, safety, and a successful educational journey for all. Educational institutions will operate from Monday to Friday based on their established school hours. Some schools will adopt a whole school approach based on physical infrastructure and school population. Other schools will operate using the alternate day system, six day cycle, thus providing at least three days of face-to-face -face instruction to students.